We want to look at the anatomy of a hurricane. We can look at it like this, a cross section where there's a lot of different components, the eye, the eye wall or the rain bands, but it makes it much easier to look at it three dimensionally. So here's that same storm once again. Here's a classic hurricane. We have the eye. The calmest part actually of the storm is the center of the storm, the eye. Sometimes even in the eye, you can have clear skies and the eye can be 20 to 40 miles wide. That's like from the Virginia Beach oceanfront all the way to Yorktown. So that's a big difference, a distance for how wide the eye. I'm going to redo that because I don't want that to live on the web forever. To be that mispronunciation that drive me crazy. All right. Doing this again, take two, in three, two, one. Looking at the anatomy of a hurricane, we can look at it like this, the cross section, there's a lot of components of it, the eye, the eye wall, the rain bands, the dense cirrus overcast top. Well, let's make it a little bit simpler. Let's look at it three dimensionally. So we have the hurricane, again, the eye, the eye wall, the eye wall, the strongest part of the storm, the eye actually the calmest part of the storm where there could even be clear skies possible and that can be 20 to 40 miles wide or 20 to 40 miles in diameter. That's like going from the Virginia Beach Ocean front to Yorktown. That's a big distance, but the eye wall is where the strongest winds are. So whenever the eye of a storm passes over an area, you don't want to go outside. You still want to be in shelter because again, wind speeds close to 100 miles an hour are possible or even stronger than that in that eye wall. But the one thing that we have to watch for here in Hampton Roads are those outer rain bands. As those move over our area, remember, they're individual thunderstorms that are banded together part of the hurricane. Those thunderstorms can have a little bit of spin. Sometimes we can even get weak tornadoes out of those outer rain bands or just in general severe weather. So different parts of the hurricane, we have the outer rain bands that connects to the center of the storm where the eye wall is, where the winds are the strongest as it's spinning around the center of the hurricane. And then of course, the center of the storm, when it's strongest, you could have a very pronounced eye that we can see.